between advances in technology and programs updating to make full use of the latest hardware, your PC might start to feel a little older as it ages. Despite Windows 10 being hailed as the last version of Windows, this still holds true. Not to worry though, just like with most things, your PC needs just a bit of upkeep to get running as good as new. The process itself is fairly simple with a bit of know-how. So if your PC has been sluggish even when your power settings are set to high performance, here's what you can do. First things first, to speed up Windows 10 on your device, you'll need to download and install the latest Windows update. Windows 10 is in constant development, and the latest update may further optimize your system to work better on the hardware you have and allow you to take full advantage of the fixes we're about to cover. Just hit the Windows key, type Update, and hit Enter. This will check for updates and open Windows Update under your Settings menu. If updates are available, hit Install and follow any on-screen prompts as they pop up. Once prompted, restart your computer. Once that's done, we can start a bit of spring cleaning. When you turn on your PC, there are a few rarely used apps that start up with your computer. To view which apps start automatically, just hit your Windows key, type Startup Apps, then hit Enter. You'll be shown a list of apps that start up with your device. Next to the app's name, you'll see a toggle that shows if this is on or off. Underneath the toggle, you can also see how this impacts your device's performance on startup. Feel free to toggle any of the apps off that you don't need automatically turning on. You'll also want to uninstall any unwanted or unneeded apps to lighten your system. To view a list of installed apps, tap on your Windows key, then type Add or Remove Programs and hit Enter. Scrolling down, you'll find a list of installed apps in alphabetical order. Next to each app is the size of the program itself, as well as the date they were added. To uninstall a program, just click on it, then select Uninstall. Follow the on-screen prompts to confirm your decision. If you encounter a program you're not familiar with, it's best to look it up and see what it is before uninstalling it. Once you're satisfied, restart your computer to see if it made a difference. For further cleaning, you can organize your desktop, turn on Storage Sense, and disable unnecessary apps in the background. Cutting down on the files you have right on your desktop means cutting down on the number of files your computer needs to load and make available on startup, which can make a difference in some cases. To turn on Storage Sense, tap the Windows key, type Storage Sense, and hit Enter to open your storage settings. Check the toggle at the top of your page to see if Storage Sense is turned on or off. If it's off, just toggle it back on. To configure its settings, click on the blue text below the toggle. To cut down on background processes, tap the Windows key, type Background Apps, and hit Enter to open a running list. Scroll and look through this list and toggle off any apps you don't want running in the background. Again, if you encounter an app you're not familiar with, it's best to look it up before you make any changes. If this still doesn't speed up your device, there is a more drastic way to power up Windows 10. You can disable animations and turn off transparency effects. This works well with lower powered PCs as well as older ones. To do this, tap on the Windows key and type View Advanced System Settings, then hit Enter. Under the Performance section, click on Settings. A list of visual effects that Windows uses will be displayed. Select Adjust for Best Performance to remove all visual effects, then click on Apply to preview how things will work. If you're not satisfied, feel free to go through the list of effects one by one to look at what you want to keep turned on. Once you're done, click OK and you're all set. Turning off transparency effects is much more straightforward. Just tap the Windows key and type Show Transparency in Windows, then hit Enter. Toggle the setting off under Transparency Effects once the Colors menu pops up. Finally, if you're not a gamer or you're having a few issues with games, turning off game mode may help as Windows 10 has this enabled by default. To turn it off, tap on the Windows key and type Game Mode Settings. Click on the toggle to turn it off and you're all set. If you like this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Windows 10 and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.